Exactly. Now, I know you got to protect the football, take it away or protect it. But uh, to me, you always have a chance if you kick an ass in the trenches. Yes. Yes. You know what? Last year, you know, Bobby, I was really pleased with one thing on the defense that we did well is we put pressure on the quarterback. You know, at one point, we were leading the uh, conference in sacks. Uh, we did cause turnovers. You know, we just didn't play very well as far as giving up the chunk plays, plays. Yeah, the chunk plays, yeah. Uh, the chunk plays, and you kill. You know, explosive plays kill you. In fact, Bobby, they're saying now explosive plays are more important than a turnover battle. I'm not going to believe that. <laughs> But you look at the last two games, we're plus nine. You know, you know, you know plus five in one game and plus four in another. That's why you're going to win. I always believe in, in the ball. But I do believe that the game is one up front. It's always going to be a big man's game. Alabama's offensive line this year was one of the better offensive lines that I've seen in a long time. Years past, they had great defensive lines. I do believe that we have a chance to be really good up front on both on both sides of the ball. Coach Ozero. I'm sorry. I'm really impressed with is from Terrebonne High School, Bobby Basin Smith. Whoa, and he and he just came on campus. Uh, he's Ooh, early. Uh, he looks like a man amongst boys already. What? Oh, I wasn't here with Tyson Jackson. I wasn't here with Michael Brockers, you know, but people around here are saying that he's reminding them of them already. Hello. I like you that. Know, <laughs> and, you know, a young man from Florida, Bryce Langston, watch out. He. He may be the best defensive lineman that I recruited since I've been there. So I feel good about the guys that we're bringing in. You know, I feel good about the graduate transfer from Clemson that's coming in. I'm excited about him. Uh, you know, we've done great with graduate transfers here. Uh, we got to find some safeties. We've got to find some dominant safeties. But we recruited two young dominant safeties. Uh, uh, Derek Davis is here already, a young man from Pittsburgh, excellent player. Sage Ryan, who's the number one safety in the country. You know, you get Elias Ricks healthy and Derek Stingley are the two number one cornerbacks in the country. So right. I'm excited about what's going on. I just got to get them to play together. That's my job. I'm excited about coaching this team more than any other team I've ever coached. And, uh, you know, Coach O, it's amazing how the game changes. And you talk about the cover corners and the guys on the outside. But uh, you know what's a sexy player? And I say sexy because uh, they didn't have this when we were growing up. It's like... It's like uh, a huge safety or a smallish linebacker. Uh, right. if they describe it like that hybrid type safety. Like the Saints have yeah. that in Chauncey Gardner Johnson. I mean, uh, hey. he can cover the slot, then he can run support. He has that swagger. Boy, that hybrid safety. Is that described uh, when you're recruiting in high school as a hybrid type safety? Or how yeah. do y'all break that down? Yeah, well, we look at you. We look at a safety that's better, closer to the ball. We look at a safety that's better in the post. But you look like Derek Davis. He's that guy. Derek Davis can start a tailback here. He's a, and not, I'm not going to say start a tailback. Could be one of our top tailbacks here. Right. But he's a great athlete. But you got to use those guys, especially with the RPOs, Bobby. If you can't cover a slot here in this league, you're going to get burnt. And as you know, you play cover four, you play cover two. You cannot let that slot have a free release at that safety. You're dead. No, you get now, burnt. Yeah, that's right. And 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 you got to cover down. See, we got to take away the RPOs, the run pass. They got a pre snap read. They got a post snap read. It's very tough. It's like the triple option. So those hybrids enable you to play the RPOs and also to play on the slot. 